hello guys so this is the new update so if you are not uh, online right now so, and you want to know the updates so what I will explain it to you uh, what are the uh, the big changes so this is it so I am now mining in the titanium island level 16 so as you can see I can mine 7200 titanium <laughs> and also there are no more island 11 and 12 and 13 there are now all level 14 but the difference is in Portsmouth there are island 15 and 16 okay so and also uh, they changed the daily mission so the Elizabeth blueprint has been removed in the point system but the good news is it is being transferred here in the daily mission selection box so inside the daily mission selection box you will find there the elizabeth blueprint which is already uh in by pair or two pieces blueprint already so no need to farm uh, before you need to get eleven thousand points because one elizabeth blueprint is five thousand five hundred so now it is very easy for us <laughs> to get titanium and internet blueprint as well okay so i think i will need to buy this so let's see so uh another update is instead of 30 before you need to hunt uh, 30 interceptors, interceptor squadrons, uh, 30 armada base. Now it's only 20, so it means it is uh, reduced. Okay, so th they add additional uh, uh, quest or mission is the rally attack on the armada base, which it needs at least one member to make us one successful rally. Okay, and also for the alliance that are very active on the uh, alliance quest, like my alliance in 1045, there is a new ranking called Blitz Defense. Okay, so uh, the point system will um, matter or differ on how many members survived during the Blitz. And also the update gives us two times uh, more ship xp during the blitz and armada bases and also i would like you to uh to show to you the rewards from the purple gift of anticipation so it's by pair the dna instructions and the medal of merit <laughs> So the blue will give us uh, module upgrades and selling boost. And the green one is obviously ship XP. All right. And what are the other changes? Yes. Uh, your collection speed will now matter on the level of your headquarters. So I think I should rush to level 27. I know before. Maybe tomorrow I will rush. I will boost it. So as you can see in the, de in the details, uh, it will increase your titanium collecting speed by 9%. So in... We need level 29 to get 12 percent at least level 29 for additional collecting speed and also in the depot wait uh the titanium capacity Uh, it has no collecting speed in the depot and also uh, have you noticed your sh uh, 
CPU power has increased because the uh, intelligent agency has now ship attack. So they have a percentage on this ship attack, and also in the radar, it has a jet attack. So I need to upgrade this. <laughs> Okay, so what are the other things that you need to know for the major update? Wait. Okay, I need this. Oops. So that's for now. <laughs> the new delimitions is quite handy right now. Uh, the Elizabeth blueprint is not available here, but you can <laughs> uh, acquire it when you complete the level uh, with the box. Wait, I just buy the polymers because it, I have only one minute left. <clears throat> I need this for my reforge. Okay, done. What's next? Oh, we got fifty seconds left. I don't know what to buy. <laughs> okay. So once you've done with the uh, daily completion reward, you can get this box. So it will give you 200,000 titanium. So titanium now, guys, is very easy to farm. You can get it from the rewards and the titanium islands as well. So I recommend if you have a remaining titanium, you sell it right now because I know the supply will increase for the Melico. Okay, so where's that box? This is the little box, the daily mission selection box. So you can choose for the Metal of Merit or the Elizabeth Blueprint. So as you can see, it will give you automatically two Elizabeth Blueprint. So... I love now the daily missions because I'm working and it's very hassle for me to do the daily missions every day. So, it daily missions now comes in very handy for people who are working and very busy like me. Okay, so this update is very nice. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to reforge my armor. And equip. Oh no, reforge. Okay, auto reforge. Okay, it took only 32 reforge to get the 5% uh, anti-ship attack. Okay, so as you can see, my my equipment has 5% ship attack on all um, parts. Okay. Thank you for watching and also in the research lab there are new, uh, new brackets for the level 2 administration battle jet and AFB munitions so what I like this is the construction speed <laughs> you can upgrade so the requirement is level 30 research lab.
<laughs> okay, for the ship, as you can see, there's a free payload. So it is impossible now that many members will not survive on the wave 8 because of this uh, new up, uh, research uh, upgrade for our ships. And the battle jet, I think we can now kill the AHG-55 with this once we complete it. Uh, this one? No. This anti-air. So the requirements is level twenty eight research lab. Uh, 